Former President Abu Mbeki has wrapped up his KwaZulu Natal election campaigning with his harsh warning to the ANC to follow its commitments. On Sunday, Mbeki paid a visit to the gravesite of John Dube at Institute of Inanda, where he stated that only the ANC has the ability to tackle the country's problems. However, as the ANC seeks votes in the May 29 election, Mbeki urged party members to speak the truth and admit their wrong things that they did. He stated in a quote, While we speak to the people to vote for the ANC, we also claim that we are working to correct things and prevent the bad things from happening. End of quote. His visit to the province was part of the party's attempt to maintain its majority vote in the KwaZulu Natal in the face of significant opposition, especially from the party led by Jacob Zuma, another former ANC president. Following a wreath laying ceremony at Dube's gravesite, Becky stated that the founding president of the South African Native National Congress, which became the ANC in 1923, would be likely the party to return to power. He stated, and I quote, We know what we need to accomplish on May 29. He would know where to mark his vote on the three ballot papers. We must do so because we need the ANC to solve our country's challenges. I am therefore saying that we carry a message with us in our hearts and in our heads that we are going to do the things we will never disappoint the Dubes expectations, Becky stated. He urged the party's officials to promote excellent conduct in order to eliminate the myth that the ANC is corrupt.